Hey guys, welcome to a workout of the week. This is a great workout that you can use as a recovery, a little some recovery sessions from your workout. So you can kind of push the pace a little bit, get a little bit of a, uh, a sweat going, or you can really push the pace hard and make it an aerobic workout. It's kind of your choice. Uh, it's like flows and planks, playing and planks. You're gonna absolutely love it. Uh, if you do this as a full workout, you're going to do five rounds of this, which is a five-minute flow and a one-minute plank. That's one round. You're going to do that five times, power max, 30 minutes. If you do this as a finisher, just do one to two flows and the couple planks that follow. So uh, scale everything to you. This is one that's super scalable to you, and don't worry about it if you're doing it right. Um, the point of this is to, I've been really into flows lately, and just trying to be able to sequence from one exercise to the next and just moving your body pushing the ranges of motion. It's great if you gotta slow it down and do like a really focus on your flexibility and mobility within these ranges of motion. Never push beyond your ranges of motion, but just play, have fun, be safe, but don't really think about it too much. All you're doing really for five minutes is you are going to just do one exercise into a movement, into another exercise, move this way, move that way, bend, twist. Uh, you can piece together anything that you want. Um, some things are try to maybe, if you can, always obviously always push the ranges of motion try to let exercises kind of sequence into each other so maybe like a reverse lunge into a side lunge into a reverse lunge the other side into a, uh, a side lunge into a squat walk out into an inchworm throw a T roll in drop your leg behind for a scorpion do a little tumble to the left do a tumble to the right do a somersault backwards or forward throw a push up in a squat do some jumping jacks a burpee kind of just one flow into the next. You're just moving your body, but in, nice, in a nice flowing sequential order, uh, getting your body used to all these ranges of motion. And you're just playing. You're having fun like you did when you were a kid. It's going to be absolutely fantastic. If you're not sure what to do, like below this in the description, there'll be like common exercises, but don't overthink it. Set, so what you're going to do is you're going to get, an, if you have an interval timer, that's great. If not, just do one round at a time and you're going to do a five minutes of flow and then follow immediately by a one minute plank. Then uh, if you have to, rest as long as you have to before you start the next flow. Again, if you want to uh, really just work on recovery, really maybe you're feeling beat up, maybe you just love that slow flow, zenish motion, go really slow. If you want to pick it up a little bit, you can. If you really want to turn it into a tough workout, you can do a quick flow, which is quick body weight movements and exercises, one to the next, one to the next for five minutes. But scale it up and down to you. Uh, again, don't overthink it. Do anything you want. If you know, you're not sure what to do, maybe you know, just start with a couple hinging toe taps. Maybe you start with the hinging toe taps, kind of get going, and maybe from the hinging toe taps, you go right into a reverse lunge with each leg. And then maybe from the reverse lunge, you do a side lunge with each leg. Coming up, going stepping side to side. And then maybe you decide to drop down into a squat. Maybe you want to do a throw and reach in while you're at the bottom of that squat. Since you're already down here, maybe you just walk your hands out into an inchworm. Maybe throw a push up in. Maybe lift the leg up. Come down, push up, lift the leg up right into a Spider-Man stretch. Pushing back, right into a Spider-Man stretch. Walk your hands back and maybe you just want to do a somersault backwards. Roll up into a squat, stand up, you just keep going and keep going. You can do anything that you want for five straight minutes. Just play with it, flow. Stay in a position longer if you want to. Uh, move through them quickly. Again, make it yours, have fun. Five rounds of that. After each round though, so five minutes of flow, buzzer will go off, then you are just holding a one minute plank. Nice tight plank, squeeze that butt, keep everything nice and level, hips slightly elevated, squeeze that core, holding that for one minute. Then you can either rest for a little bit or just go right back into a flow. Five minutes of flow, one minute plank, that's six minutes I believe. Do that five times, that should be 30 minutes. Never been good with math, but uh, this is a great uh, workout to Really, really modify and adjust to you, however you want to make it happen. Life is good, isn't it? Play some rap music, get some friends. Let's all get fit this week.